of the connections good enough? Yeah, it, it, it sort of looks fine. Oh, I just need to grab these. So uh, let me do this. I'll just. Uh, Hi. Um, so the Spellbinders team. Uh, some of us are here a little early. There's Josie and Robin. Because um, we're having a reception at the Hyatt um, in the atrium. And as I'm writing out some of the names, I thought it might be interesting for you to see what I do when, um, when I'm trying to do stuff really quickly. So Josie's just going to hold the phone so that you can see me rushing through some names for, for some of the attendees. Oh, I need your phone. Because my list is yeah, on my phone. Right. <laughs> <laughs> is that focus? Uh, yeah, that looks all right. Where are we at? Where are we at? Tracy. Cindy. So, we, yeah, we could just go a little bit closer there. Yeah, that's better. Tracy. Isn't that Karen? Oh, tra the other Tracy. I So I'm using Dr. P.H. Martin's Beatproof White. So you just feel me putting it on. So if you show them the rest, show them those, that would be great. So where are we at? Everybody's looking for their name, I'm sure. I'm gonna get you a little bit closer, Paul. Okay. There we go. Perfect. Beautiful. So I want you to look at this right now. Look, I've put this little lip. So there are about maybe six or seven bits of paper here. And I'm just holding it, hovering it on the edge. So look at the amount of bounce that you have here. And that's this little trick that I've been trying to get you guys to learn, where you're using the paper to help spring. So I'm gonna write another name. Whilst I'm writing that name, what I want you to pay attention to is I want you to look at how the page is moving okay, I got it. to assist with the hairline. So where are we at? T. So I, I use this this oval exercise. I like a little a little dollop of ink, and then I do this, and then this. For things like S and and C, because I I love that entry stroke. Of course, I talk about these different techniques in the manual about the steepness of the nib, how to glide across the paper, and how to use this, this bouncing technique to help you achieve much smoother, lighter, more delicate hairlines. So, so, so this is something else that I do. So I'm gonna take a few sheets of paper, and then I'm going to curl them just a little bit so that, so that they have a little curve. And then I'm gonna put that just on the edge there 
so you see that bounce so you have quite a lot of lift there and that lift is one of the things that really helps me to get those really beautiful elegant delicate hairlines So I've run out of ink here. So what I'm going to do is this. No, look at this. I'm going to retrace the letter. And one, and two, three, and four, and five. So don't don't just try to start the letter where you've where it's it's stopped. Try to go back into the letter. Um, and by going back into the letter rhythmically you get that sort of smoothness and that elegance and it, it looks like okay fine you made a mistake because you didn't time the the, the ink of course I'm I'm sort of talking to you and trying to concentrate on the name so I'm not concentrating <laughs> on the ink um, but that's a really great tip to help you see how how to write effectively. Of course, knowing the names that you always mess up on is really important. So I always mess up on, on Barbara and Margaret because I always have to think Barbara and Margaret. Otherwise, I end up putting M A. M A G, and then I have to get another card, and I'm already short on them. I'm just gonna take this to the camera so you could see. So you can really see those hairlines. Yeah, you can. They're really delicate and really, really light. I'm gonna try, I'm gonna get another one over here. Okay. Oh, here, you can see this one really well. Because of course, as they dry, the, the, they dry slightly darker. Well, later, what, what, what we'll do is uh, we'll hang up and um, we'll come back on a little later on when I'm giving my little presentation. Let me just grab the phone quickly. Yep, you say goodbye to your people. Uh, so I'm, I'm going to go because I need to concentrate because chatting with you is not helping. <laughs> uh, chatting with you is not helping me concentrate on the ink. I will, um, I'll come back on a little later on because I have to give a little presentation on um, a topic that I love. So I'm going to pick one letter from the alphabet and I'm going to show the, um, the attendees of this evening's um, little cacti and cocktails event um, how one of these letters evolves across two and a half thousand years um, of a Western alphabet. So if you don't catch it tonight, then uh, pick it up tomorrow. Again, it's only going to be on for for 24 hours. I, I'm not going to post that one on my on my Facebook. All right, see you guys later. Thanks for hopping on so late. Have a good evening. Bye bye.